So this term, you are going to be working with exponents. In your syllabus for mathematics grade eight, you shall be having exponents, which is very, very important that you do understand everything on exponents. There are laws that you need to understand or to know as long you are working with exponents. So this is a revision that we are going to talk about on our exponents, all right? So it follows that if you are given numbers like questions of this situation that you're given here, these are typical questions or types of questions that we are going to work with in this class. Let's say you are multiplying numbers. This is the condition of your exponents. You are going to be having a situation like this, two, times a two, we know that two times a two, that is a four. The product of these two numbers is a four. But they want you to rewrite this in exponential form, not to give the answer like this, no. We want to know how many twos are there that are multiplying each other to two like this. How many? That is one, two. So when it is like this, it means two to the power of a two. The number of times this two is multiplying itself. Okay, you don't understand me because there is a two and a two. Let me do this way. Two times a two times a two. So the question is, how many twos are we having that are multiplying each other? One, two, two. Three, they are three of them. So this is two, the number that you are having here to the power of, so the power here is the number of times that number is multiplying itself. The number of times, that is the number of times. Uh, the number is multiplying itself, is multiplying itself. All right, so that is the idea there. So the number of times, how many? We said one, two, three. It is multiplying itself three times. So this will be to the exponent of three. So this can be written or can be expressed as two to the power of a three. So this is the situation that we are given here. Exponential notation, which is the exponential form. Okay? That is the exponential form. So this is the one. So here we are calculating two times two. You calculate your value two times two. That is a four times a two which is four times two, that's eight. That is to calculate three times three, that is nine. Nine times three, that is a 27. So you just multiply your numbers. But we are saying instead of writing this number three times, we it can be written as three to the power of six, the number three, the best, and six is the exponent. So six is the exponent, which is the power to the power of six. So this is what we know we want to have as the exponential notation, which is this part, the exponential form. So this is the F for number two. So, but on this one, we want it like, what is the executive value there? Okay, so on this situation, the same questions that you have here and you're writing the answer, which is eight, which is 27. Now you're not writing the answers, no. The question is just, you are supposed to write this in exponential form. How many twos are we having? So that's two, eight. How many twos? One, two, three. So this is two to the exponent of three. Two to the power of three. Okay, let's move on to B. How many twos? One, two, three, four, five, six. So this can be written as two to the power of six. Two to the exponent of a six. Let's move on to C. How many threes? One, two, three. These are threes it's a three so that's three to the exponent the number of times it is multiplying itself how many times one two three so it is multiplying itself three times the same thing with the d one two three 
two, three, four, five, six. So three is multiplying itself six times. That is what the question is about there. It is multiplying itself six times. That is the question. All right. Now we are given a condition. Calculate the value of the following three. Uh, that is question three A. Calculate the value of the following item one, five to the exponent of a two. Remember the exponent here means the number of times this number five is multiplying itself. The number of times that this number five is multiplying itself. So this means it is five times, it is multiplying itself how many times? Two times, five times five. And what is five times five? It is a 25. That is the case. So this is five times five. So that's what I want you to do on these questions, all right? We are given b2 to the exponent of a 5. What does it mean? It means the 2, which is the best that we are given here, it is multiplying itself how many times? It is multiplying itself 5 times. So that is going to be 2 times a 2 times a 2 times a 2 times a 2. How many times? 1, 2, three, four, five, that's it. So if you want to write the executive value, that is gonna be two times a two, which is a four times a two, which is gonna give us eight. So if you multiply this four and two, that's gonna be eight. Eight times these two, that's a 16. 16 times these two, that's a 32. So at the end, if you multiply everything, you are going to obtain a 32. But in this case, it can be expanded in this way. Remember, we had the same presentation before. So these are the typical questions that you are going to be given. You need to know the exponential form to evaluate these numbers uh, that you are given in terms of your exponent. So we shall have more questions of this nature. Make sure that you subscribe to, th to this channel, Mets on African Motives, so that you are equipped for every class that we are going to have from now onwards.